One of the things that makes Starlight Stage special is the personal SSR dresses that come with each costume, even though they're very hard to obtain. So we here from the channel wanted to make a fashion review of these dresses and the connection with the idol. We are by no means experts in this topic, and this is something that we've been doing for fun. So if this is something that you would like to see more often, please tell us if you do want to see more and any specific cards from any game that you would like us to discuss. For our first entry, we'll be looking at a personal favorite of someone from the channel, Mori Kubonono's dress, specifically her SSR, Mori no Monogatari, or Forest Story. The outfit is a countenance or a combination of her R and R plus cards, or the fairy tale and gothic cards, and it combines the green color, the frills and the torso of the first with the butterfly pattern, the adornments of the head and arms of the second. Let's compare that later. Nono's dresses seem to be inspired from Lolita fashion, specifically sweet Lolita fashion. Nono's preference for pastel colors is reflected in her fashion choice and in her cards. Her R and R plus, or the fairy tale and gothic cards, are very recognizably of Lolita fashion, with the latter's name seemingly referring to gothic Lolita with the darker and contrasting color scheme, minus the crosses, skulls, and roses that are usually associated with it. Many of Nono's outfits have her wearing Lolita headbands as seen in her R and SSR cards, and she also has a miniature hat in her R plus card. Nono's dresses often reflect the theme of fairy tales and fantasy, but this dress is even more so. It is named Forest Story and literally gives the setup of a story that happens in a forest. It doesn't get any more fairy tale-ish than that. In the skirt, we have a design of a forest and a castle inside the forest, a good touch for Nono's shy personality. The castle in the pattern is the focal point with it being in the center. The subpanels also act to illustrate the stories in the forest. There is a cottage in the forest, rainbows, and several little critters in the forest. The castle image combines all the different elements of the other patterns, namely the swans, the trees, and the flowers of the cottage image. Swans are featured as a common element of fairy tales as they are symbols of tranquility, beauty, and grace. Throughout the dress, ribbons are shaped in the form of butterflies. The shoe has the same pattern with the green butterflies. The heel of the shoe is wood-colored, adding on to the forest theme of this dress. If you would notice, the peculiar characteristic of this outfit is that Nono's eyes look straight as compared to her other models. Her eyes in this aspect reflects the growth of Nono as an idol. As for the colors, the dress uses Nono's image color, which is a shade of cyan for a majority of the outfit, though tinged more green and higher in saturation in the 3D model as compared to the card illustration. Darker shades of the color are used in the ribbon and lace. White is used for the frills on the dress, on the strings of the pearls, and on Nono's socks. In the 3D model, the use of pale blue tint in the white brings the overall color of the dress closer to the desired cyan of Nono's image color. The pearls remain pure white in the 3D model. Other than in the colorful fairy tale imagery in the skirt, the use of pink, yellow, and amber can be seen throughout the costume. Amber is only used in the frill of the skirt and the outline of the frill above the chest. Yellows are kept to the flower motifs, while pinks can be seen in the flowers and on the skirt imagery. The imagery aims to break the otherwise large section of green on the skirt, and the pink serves to harmonize the warm tones of the skin to the cool tones of the dress. There is also a light bluish gradient from the waistline down to the halfway of the skirt, tinting the pink into a light purple. This then brings the pink to match the cools, making for a harmonious blend of colors. As mentioned above, Nono's SSR dress is a mix of elements from her R and R plus cards, and they are from the fairy tale and gothic cards, as we have previously mentioned. Starting from the top, her Lolita headband in her SSR has the ribbons replaced with butterfly shaped ribbons with the butterflies coming from her second card and they can be seen in her mini hat as well. We hope you enjoyed this short but sweet look at Nono's SSR dress Mori no Monogatari. This is something experimental for the channel, so we hope you liked it. If you have any recommendations or any point that you would like to add or remove, please write us any feedback. If you want to see more of these types of videos, you may request us a card or a character from a different series and we'll get that to you as well. This has been the Idolmaster Subs channel and we'll see you on the next video.